morning. Still gotta brush my teeth. I got that morning mouth. <laughs> anyway, check it out. <laughs> I just gave Jeff a little present. <laughs> yeah, anyway. So you probably noticed I got a new hat. Um, I ended up buying this one in a store because the one I had made for myself earlier, that bucket hat, I can't find it anywhere right now. And uh, I'm not sure where it went to. Anyway, um, I didn't have time to sew anything up, so I just bought this one and it packs down really small. And uh, that's great. Yeah, it packs down like this. Do that. It's a really, really nice view, viewpoint up there. Mm -hmm. Guys, I was trying to do the walking shot of us both walking down the trail. And Mark just keeps going. <laughs> I'm like, shit. Yeah, maybe. Uh, not yet, but these are great, these needles, though. Grab a bunch of those. Put that in your tea. And drink it. Pretty high in vitamin C. All right, we'll give this a go. I got a little worm on a hook on this one. And uh, that's it, no no weights or anything like that. I just have the bobber on it, like that. So you can hear like a little background conversation. There's a there's a few people over there enjoying a little sandy part of the beach and not the only one out here. There's some people over on that side there, look like they're fishing. And then there's a guy over there that's fishing over there. So you know it other people come here too. There's some white thing way up there too. Yeah, I wish I brought my vinos with me. Don't mind the bee, guys. <laughs> Do something like. <laughs> Canadian shoreline acoustic <laughs> ambience or whatever. That's what I'm looking at. That white spot right there. In the middle of that scree slope. I'm looking at it like this, so it looks fine. That's funny. Share in the wild, literally. <laughs> Hard to tell if they're just like that or they've been in the uh, the alcoholic beverages, if you know what I mean. Oh. 
It's beautiful out here though. It's super calm, super nice. I love it. Got, got one guys. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh, actually, it almost looks like a white fish. White fish? Let's see. No. Sure. Here you go. Yeah, no, that's a little little trout. Yep. <laughs> oh. Ooh there we go. Got a little brook, you guys. Line down. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Slippery little sucker. He went back to the wild, you guys. <laughs> yeah, catch and release. <laughs> Oops. That's pretty good. <laughs> catch a bigger one now, hopefully. Nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I gotta go get another worm. Be right back. So I, I caught one, but it got away. <laughs> I had it in my hands, so you're going to see it in the video. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try and catch another one, hopefully a bigger one than the last one. Just little, little bits and pieces for those guys. And YouTube doesn't get it, which is... No, which is nice. The cool thing is the Patreon is just, it's all core supporters and yeah. lots of love and it's like... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Set it? Yep. Can you turn the camera around? Yeah. Oh, he's a nice one. Beautiful. Twice in one day. <laughs> <laughs> what are the chance? <laughs> what are the chances of that? I'm gonna try this again. That's two fish now that I've lost. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. Kind of slow at the moment. Use the message to boys. Tell them to come down here. They can bring more booze. Oh, but it's later in the day. They've got over their hangover. Gonna go give another little spot around this lake a shot. So we'll see. Got one, dude. Got one? Yep. Might as well.
he just uh he really swallowed this hook like it's just about there so Many snails actually. It's a snail. A couple snails in there, right? Mm-hmm. So here's what happened. This camera phone battery died. And then, so I started filming with my other phone and then it died. And then I thought it would be really good if we could fly the drone, but I got to charge the phone battery first so that I could pair it all up. And I knew if I plugged the phone into the controller, it would charge from the controller too, the, like the DJI drone controller. And so I checked it, plugged it in and it's like, yep, it's charging, it's all good. <laughs> So I get the drone up in the air and it's flying around. I'm trying to get some cool shots. Mark's flying the drone and I'm like, how's the battery? And he's like, yeah, it looks good. It says there's about six minutes of flight time left. I'm like, okay. And then uh, the phone dies. So the drone's up there flying. And I was like, oh shoot, how do we deal with this? And then uh, I guess what happened is the batteries got low enough that it was just the, the controller started beeping. It came over above the home point and it came down right here, but it was like way up there. And as it was coming down, we're watching it dodge some of the branches and the trees above us here. And it clipped one of them and I thought it would fall for sure, but it didn't, it recovered and it kept coming down and then I was able to grab it. <laughs> and then it, it wanted to take off at that point and I couldn't turn it off with the button. So then I had to pull the battery out while it was trying to take off in my hand. Anyway, all that happened and ended up catching another fish. And uh, so we've got a few fish now and I might catch one more. Mark is super excited. So he just left and he's going back to town to get his fishing license. And he's gonna come back here and join me. And then uh, there might be a little bit of light left for him to do some fishing tonight before it does uh, ease up. But it could also, I'm just, I'm keeping an eye on my bobber over there. Uh, Cause I got a line out. Anyway, he's going to come back and then uh, we'll uh, we'll eat the fish. So in the meantime, I'm going to get a fire going and uh, and yeah, just sort of set this area up a little bit so we can uh, we can have fish. And he's got some some stuff. I got some stuff. So anyway, we're going to catch our cook or cook our <laughs> we're we're, we're going to cook our catch. Oh, that's a start. I just need a, a little bit of tinder or something to get it going. I see some old man's beard. There we go. That'll be enough.
of the day. Beautiful. Catch and cook. That is so good. You have no idea how good that is. <laughs> You hear that sound? My van is full of bugs. Like, look at this guy. <laughs> I left my window open and, and I guess they, they just came in here. Oh, that sucks. And for reference, <laughs> he's pretty decent. Yeah, that's a pretty decent one for sure. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Pots and pans. Yeah, there you go. Who could that be? I gotta get a sticker for my own channel. The cabin was free, guys, so this is where we're gonna spend the night. And we already got the fire going, so yeah. It's all right. I had to move last night. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get up, I'll tell you later. <sighs> I got my coffee this morning. Last night was interesting. Yeah, essentially we pulled up to the cabin and went to go camp there last night got the fire going and all that and then uh, some car pulled up and these guys got out and they totally crashed our party but well, they started talking about the cabin and mark hadn't seen the inside of the cabin yet so like, have you seen the inside he opened it up and they had it all cozied out homed out they had all their belongings in it clearly they had been there for a little while and so it just made sense for us to move so we did and I guess what they did is they probably just went into town or something like that to get a few things and then came back out. And, uh, and we were there, unbeknownst to them. Anyway, we did end up going somewhere else, but it kind of ruined our morning plan to have a fire and cook those fish. So, I might, might have to cook mine in the van later on today or something. All right, that's it, that's a wrap. Um, gotta go to Vancouver now. see my girl and uh, spend some time with her 